Rhinebeck, New York, a Hudson River town swimming in quaintness, is hosting the wedding of the century. Not that anybody on the inside will say for sure that this is where Chelsea Clinton will marry investment banker Mark Mezvinsky on July 31st. Josh Croner, who owns one of the best restaurants in town, might be catering part of it, and he might not. Whether we have this wedding or not, it's not something I'm at liberty to talk about. At the Beekman Arms, which is all booked that weekend, Chelsea Inquiries will get you a polite no comment. Everyone else is talking about it, though. I think, uh, you know, Rhinebeck needs this. You know, any year. I mean, every town in America needs a big wedding. Even James Chapman, who's in at Rhinecliff, isn't involved in the wedding, but is one of the first sights guests will see if they make the 115-mile trek up from New York City by train. Can't oh, yes, resist. Everybody, everybody's talking about it. Everybody wants to know if uh, somebody else knows something new that's not out there yet. The site of the wedding, a riverfront estate, which we can't show you because it's private, built for John Jacob Astor IV in 1902. In the absence of confirmed information, residents trade tasty tidbits of rumor. So, beyond the unprepossessing entrance here to a 50-acre estate, we are told there's a battalion of volunteer firemen watering the lawns. The locals are enjoying their moment in the sun, but not expecting it to last. Uh, this is sort of a relatively sleepy town, so I think that something like this uh, creates enough of a stimulation to give us uh, some excitement, but then we can proceed back into our sleepy town, which we like. While Rhinebeck enjoys its moment of Chelsea mania, provided nobody talks too much about it, the wildest rumor for a time was that this was all an elaborate head fake and that the wedding would take place somewhere else. Warren Levinson, The Associated Press.